Uh, welcome everyone, thanks for coming to the Games User Research Summit US 2018. Uh, my name is Phil. So my name is Phil, I'm with Activision uh, for the research department for our side. Um, so also director of the summit, surprise. So real quick, want to do an opening for you. Uh, so here, just want to give you some details. Uh, we'll go into a little bit about kind of what we're doing today after that. Uh, just wanted to give you some highlights and some little tidbits about some of the stuff that we're doing um, specifically for this year, right? Uh, so as of this morning, uh, we had over 220 registered attendees. So we are growing. Uh, overall, between the two tracks, we're gonna have at least 20 different presenters, right? So um, some panels, some individual talks. Uh, I definitely encourage you guys, uh, please feel free to reach out to these people if you have any additional questions or just wanna talk to them really during any of the breaks or anything, um, you know, they're happy to help. Uh, additionally, we've got over 15 companies and universities represented, uh, whether it be through the micro talks or the individual tracks. Um, so again, good number of people representing because just a variety of different aspects. So, um, you know, the, the major theme we wanted for this year and kind of thinking about this is, is really building. Right? So every year we're talking about kind of how do we grow user research uh, across the globe, uh, even within our own company. But also, you know, we've gotten a lot of feedback over the years that we're looking for kind of more feedback to help you know, with junior beginner researchers. Like, how do you do the fundamentals of this? How do we increase and improve and, you know, again, expand overall? So thinking carefully about this, um, we looked at the content that um, all of you guys submitted. We made some, some hard choices, but we're really happy with kind of where it panned out. So, you know, we're gonna represent kind of a larger spread. Um, I know traditionally there's a lot of console games that kind of get um, promoted. But in this case, you know, we're gonna look at a lot of PC titles, we've got a few mobile talks, um, we've got VR represented, indie, and even board games, which I'm really excited about. Uh, and that's to kind of, you know, build out the breadth of it, right? So, you know, we're games user research, traditionally we think of it as just kind of video games. Uh, but here, it's, it's really all games that we're really talking about. Additionally, uh, building up. So we're talking about, you know, building up the juniors and kind of delivering and, and improving them to kind of, you know, again, expand everything that we're doing. Um, several different things to help them. So we got the mentoring section with uh, James Bird, um, going into survey methodology, a couple of analytics panels, uh, handling difficult topics, and then also just kind of fresh approaches. All right, so new ways to really think and kind of react to the different research that we've got. Uh, just for some admin stuff here, so again, just a reminder, please, if you have your phones, uh, either turn them off or please have them on silent uh, during any of the talks. Restrooms are gonna be in the back hallway. So if you guys go all the way to this end hallway here, uh, in the back there, there's both men and female restrooms. And also, if needs be, there are public restrooms outside the mall. Uh, lunch, plan to be served at 12 o'clock um, in the entry foyer. So uh, we'll have box lunches for everybody. Uh, feel free to head out there. Uh, as far as where you meet, uh, we've got some tables in the back here in this room. Uh, also, we'll have some you know, high boy tables out there. Uh, also, there's some tables out in the mall if needs be. So feel free to squat wherever you need on that. And then breaks, uh, according to schedule, we've got 10, 3, and 5, 15. Uh, just one thing, please, um, you know, we have a lot of good sponsors that came and helped us out. We've got three specifically represented in the foyer. If you guys get a chance, feel free to visit them. You know, we want to encourage, you know, they're helping us out a lot. So feel free to take some time just to chat with them. And again, just talking about the sponsors real quick, just want to thank all the guys who, uh, you know, guys and gals who helped us out with this. There are plenty, so you know, big thanks to everyone who uh, helped with this uh, the sponsorship stuff. So. And also uh, the committee. So you know, we had a lot of dedicated people who volunteered their time, uh, a lot of time to kind of help make the summit possible. So again, yeah, feel free, you know, thank them if you see them. Uh, really appreciate all the work that they put in. You know, again, our volunteers and everyone who helped also with the content review, right? So, um, you know, we had a, a good group of people who helped us just kind of look through and make recommendations. So, you know, again, a lot of people went into help making this great. So, please provide feedback as you can. <laughs> and last couple stuff here, um, just to note. So next year, um, director is going to be Nick Van Martin. So definitely, you know, talk to him. If you're interested in helping out, if you want to join the committee or just find other ways you might be able to help the game SIG group, uh, feel free to email him directly. 
And then you'll have this URL throughout the, uh, throughout the entire summit. Uh, but again, if you want to provide feedback for any of the talks, and I highly encourage you guys to, uh, you know, we're trying to improve and expand on things, please just go ahead and enter that in. Uh, that'll be the same URL for any talk you're given. Just select which talk you went to and provide the feedback that's needed. And again, on social media, if you guys uh, want to send out pictures, text, whatever, uh, hashtag is going to be games you are. And last thing, just to kind of note, tee up. So at the end of the summit, we also have our post-summit social. So uh, after the event, uh, we're going to have a hard stop basically at 6 o'clock today. At that point, we're going to move all the fun over to Smokestack. Uh, Magnolia Brewing Company. Uh, just a couple things here to note. Uh, I know it's a little bit farther, so we do have transportation available. Uh, just a note that is transportation for up to 55 people. Uh, what I want to do is please encourage, if you're from a company that has a really a fantastic uh, expense policy, uh, please <laughs> try and take like a lift or something. Uh, really hoping to get people who you know don't necessarily have that budget or maybe you know on a student's budget uh, to kind of use that. But again, that will be available, and uh, we'll talk about the details of that. But essentially, there's a bus pickup that at 6:10, so you'll have to kind of hustle out of the, the thing. So if you need to use the transportation, keep that in mind during the uh, closing speech. But that's it. <laughs>